Welcome to my YouTube channel Modi Mechanical Engineering Tutorials. In this video, I would like to explaining about in details theory about wire drawing process. So basically, wire drawing process that will be having a wide applications in the field of engineering. So in this video, I would like to explaining about the process and its uh, applications. So let us start with the theory. So just you can see the basic setup for the wire drawing process. Here the drawing die is being used and basically this die is made of the hardened steel material and according to the cross sectional area of the product is being required it will be designed. So just you can see from this left side this raw material is being available and this raw material it will be forcefully to pull into this direction and it will be converting into the reducing cross sectional area or you can say in the form of wire or in the form of load so that will be depends upon my product so important thing is die angle so this die angle that will be used to reducing the cross sectional area so in that theory of the wire drawing which is very simple process because in this process road made of the steel or you can say also considering as a non ferrous metals like aluminium copper alloys these all materials it will be having a good ductility so easily converting into desired shape and size and basically with the application of this force it will be pulled into this hole center and according to this cross sectional area it will be having a cross sectional shape and size so this included angle of the cone is capped between 8 degree to 24 degree which is depends upon your applications as the material is pulled through this cone or you can say die it undergoes plastic deformation or you can say permanent deformation of raw material which is converting into desired shapes or you can say desired cross sectional area and it gradually undergoes a reduction in its diameter so here the diameter it will be reducing and length that will be increasing so in that case of the wire drawing process at same time length is increased proportionality after this just you can see this die tend to wear out fast due to the continuous rubbing of the metal being pulled through it because if you start to pull this material this outer surface of the raw material which is directly in contact with the inner surface of the dies. So this area it will be weared out because it will be having a higher tension force. Hence they made of the very hard material like uh, alloy steel that already discussed hardened steel, tungsten carbide or even sometimes diamond material it will be also used to control the wear of this die. So most of the wire drawing process, its accuracy and its shapes, it will be depends upon the die openings and die materials. So in one pass, the reduction in cross sectional area achieved is about 25 to 30 percent. Process of the drawing may be smoothly carried out. If you want more reduction into this diameter, so it will be double pass system, it will be arranged. Hence, in a wire drawing plant, the wire has to pass through a number of dies of the progressive reducing diameter to achieve the required reduction in diameters that we discuss. However, as the wire passes through the dies, it undergoes plastic deformation or you can say permanent deformations and it gets strain hardened. So, for that, the strength is being increased and the uh, capacity of the further undergo plastic deformation that will be decreasing so therefore during the entire this run of the wire or you can say manufacturing of the wires or road from time to time it has to be heated to remove the effect of the work hardening or you can say in simple way it will be heat and cool simultaneously during this process so it will be known as a work hardening so to remove the effect of the work hardening that will be the methodology it will be heat and cool during the process so you can say in simple way this process is known as annealing process so due to that annealing process or you can say simply 
heating and cooling during that process. So that raw material it will be easily converting into desired shape and according to requirement of our size. And the benefit is what the effect of the work hardening that will be developing during this fire drying process it will be removed or you can say reduced in matters. So the aim is to make the material soft and ductile again so that the process of the wire drying may be smoothly carried out. Then after during the wire drying the great deal of the heat is generated due to the friction between the wire road and the dye materials. So here this area or you can say contact angle that will be having a maximum friction area for the dye materials. So to reduce these frictions dry soap or you can say sometimes synthetic lubricant is used to increasing the effectiveness of the manufacturing as well as the increasing the life of the dye material. But despite the reducing the friction the dyes and drums may have to be water cool that will be the another availability. So the perfect material for the dye is tungsten carbide but for drawing fine wires use of rubby or diamond dyes is very much preferable. The major variables into wire drawing process are the first one reduction ratio. So reduction ratio or you can say diametrical reduction ratio you can say cross sectional ratio. Sometimes another important parameter that will be the die angle which is depends and you have to control the friction between this raw material and the inner surface of the die. So these three parameters it will be having a variable considering you have to control these three variables for increasing the effectiveness of the process as well as the effectiveness of the product or you can say increasing the life of the dye materials. So improper control of these parameters will causes the defects into drawn the materials. Defects include center cracking and formation of longitudinal scratches or you can say falls into material. So wire drying process itself it will be used to make a uh, wire materials that will be used into electrical appliances, household applications, industrial applications. Sometimes for making a uh, road materials or you can say solid road, hollow pipes. So these all process is being used into wire drying. Basically as from the name wire drying. So with the application of pull force onto raw materials and that will be passing through the dies and it will be converting into wire form. So such kind of material having a good ductility that will be used as a wire drawing process. So I hope you can understand this. If you like this then subscribe and share. Modi Mechanical Engineering Tutorials. Thank you so much.